More Nigerians living in West African nations have started returning to the country through land borders following the rise in COVID-19 cases globally. The Minister of Foreign Affairs, Geoffrey Onyema, at a price, press conference rather, organized by the Presidential Task Force on COVID-19 in Abuja on Wednesday, said 67 persons had already arrived at the country's land border. The minister, who did not indicate the land border that the returnees were, stated that 24 more would come in today. 67 uh, Nigerians, including children, men and women, um, they were in uh, Côte d'Ivoire. And um, so we needed to uh, engage with the governments of uh, Togo uh, and the government of Bena uh, for them to be able to, to go through. And they are now at the Nigerian border and um, we got the authorization for them to come into the country. And they will be uh, in, a, in isolation uh, for uh, the mandatory uh, 14 days once they have come in. Uh, we have another 24 uh, Nigerians in uh, Togo uh, in a hotel and um, they're going to be tested and uh, we've also got uh, the government of uh, Bena's approval for them to also move through uh, Beninois territory to come into Nigeria so possibly by uh, tomorrow. We've arranged also to um, uh, where they will all be um, confined uh, when they come into uh, the, the country. So that's been going very smoothly. And for this, we're extremely uh, grateful to the governments of Togo and the governments of uh, Bena Republic, uh, who have really cooperated with us and made this uh, um, possible. Um, with regards to the uh, question of uh, evacuation, um, I think maybe just to also get, uh, make it clear that uh, the uh, presidential task force under the uh, chairmanship of uh, the SGF, the secretary to the government, um, had actually um, been engaging with this question right from the beginning, uh, right from uh, when there was a closure uh, of um, the, the, the airport. So it was not, um, the, the response is not as a result of letters or whatever that have been coming in from Nigerians in the diaspora, as has been uh, uh, mentioned in some media houses, but actually something that was taken up by the uh, task force right from the very beginning. But of course, at that time, we did not have uh, all our isolation centers in place and all the other uh, logistical arrangements in place.